Hello students, here I am going to discuss about transportation problem, Northwest Corner Method. So, my aim is to obtain the optimum basic feasible solution for the given transportation problem. So, we are uh, here, the transportation problem by Northwest rule using Tora method we are doing. See here students, you have got destinations D1, D2, D3, D4. That means four destinations are there and you have sources S1, S2 and S3. So, three sources are there and supply and demand are totals right so here just click on start search for tora here i have got tora click on tora click on click here again you will get another window click on transportation model here just click on go to input screen uh, it is already clicked here enter new problem so click here then click right click on problem title write any title you want as we are doing northwest corner method i'm writing northwest corner then here i just now we have seen in the uh, question we have how many sources students s1 s2 s3 and destinations four so three sources and four destinations so that means three rows we are having and four columns right click on four columns click enter here you will get this type of screen then come click here and just write the whole problem it is six oh, written here and four with one five and in place of supply it is 14 then here it is eight nine two seven and sixteen yeah then Four, three, six, two, and five. Four, three, six, two, and here it is five. And down here it is six, ten, fifteen, and four. It is thirty. Six, ten, fifteen, four. That's it. So here I have written six four one five correct. Then say eight nine two seven. Uh, it is correct. Then four three six two four three six four three. Here it is six. Here as we are going with this problem, students, I'm writing all those values here. That's why I'm just cross-checking it whether I have written correct or not. Then here it is 15. Here it is 15 students. This is 1, 5. Because this total, that means 6, 10, 15, 4, it will be 35. And 14, 16 and 5 will be 35. This uh, demand and supply will be equal. That's why I'm just cross-checking it. Then students, after writing all this, just click on solve menu. Uh, do you want, wish to save data? I don't want to save data. I'm just showing you, know, click on no and solve problem. In solve problem, click on iterations. Here you have northwest corner and least cost Vogel's approximation. You can do any of the three. I am doing northwest corner. Click on northwest corner method. You have got here the answer. Click on all iterations. You will get the three iterations is optimal. This is the third iteration we have got. The final solution it is 114 the answer. Thank you for li listening to my lecture. Do like, share and subscribe students.